The femoral line man system offers many of the same key features as central line man, including the palpable pulse, adjustable venous pressure, and two colors of simulated blood. The system includes the human pelvis with identifiable landmarks, including the anterior superior iliac spine, the pubic tubercle, and the inguinal ligament. Like central line man, femoral line man is also easy to maintain, and each replaceable tissue should last for approximately 20 to 25 full catheter insertions, or 100 to 200 needle sticks. Now let's take a closer look at what to expect when performing the procedure. When using landmarks of the anterior superior iliac spine and the pubis symphys, you will be able to find the femoral artery and the inguinal ligament. You will see a blue flashback of fluid if you hit the vein and red if you hit the artery. An ultrasound imaging unit can be incorporated into this procedure. Begin by turning up the gain on the ultrasound unit and applying gel to the tissue before proceeding. Search and find the vessels on the imaging unit. By using the arterial pump, you can create a pulse and easily identify the artery by squeezing the bulb a quarter to half way and continue pumping the bulb in and out. You can use the syringe to lower the venous pressure to show low pressure complications. To do this, withdraw 20 milliliters of venous blood into the syringe. You should visually notice the vein flattening. Femoral lineman also allows practice of full catheterization.